Hi traders, Joseph here from ACAP. Uh, today's video, we're going to focus on drawing trend lines on the MetaTrader 4 platform. So we're going to uh, start by going over to the drawing buttons. If you're unable to see those buttons, just go over to view, to toolbars, and make sure line studies has been ticked. So we select uh, the draw trend line. And then we'll go down to the chart. And we're going to look uh, to start to draw a trend line. So we're going to look for two points. So a high, uh, low. And then we connect those two points. Or mainly to where generally the lows have been getting higher. So we'll see that our trend line is a big, long, straight line. If you haven't uh, used MetaTrader 4, and it may be set to Ray, and that's why it's set as this one good solid line. If you'd like to change that so you can control the trend line, you just double click on the trend line and then right click, go to properties, and just deselect ray and hit OK. You'll see then the trend line becomes a lot shorter. So while these boxes are visible, you can then manually move the trend line by clicking on it and just moving it with your mouse. So to lock the trend line, you just double click with the uh, left mouse button. And to edit the trend line, double click again, and then right click. So in this position, you can uh, delete the trend line if you wanted to remove it. And you can also go to the properties. So under common, you can change the color of the trend line, the style, and the thickness. You can also give a description or change the name. You can also set under this tab what time frames you'd like it to be shown on. And you can also manually change the parameters of the trend line yourself. So another way to delete the trend line and any other, uh, so if we do a few more, you can right click on the chart and go to object list. These will show all the different trend lines you have currently on the chart. You can select different trend lines you'd like to delete. Just leaving one particular line if, if that's what you chose to do. So we'll delete this one. So when you're looking at uh, drawing trends, like we just said before, you, you're looking for the general direction of the market. So we can see in this area here that the market was rallying. And it made a new higher high at this point. So that high was beaten, and this is our new high. So we can see once this trend line was broken and the market started to move down here we had a new trend line and once broken by this counter rally and we move down again we had a new trend line here we'll just remove that one or oh, we'll edit that so this here is now the longer term trend line on confirming of a break of this counter rally. And we've gone down now and we've made a new counter rally at this point here. So we won't know yet whether we have one more extension to test this point or we have a resumption of the trend and possibly set up a new faster trend line to this point here. So when we're looking at trends you have you can have the overall trend and then you can have your faster trends inside the trend and you can have counter trends inside the trend. And again just um, for another example sake if you'd like to remove all of those lines quickly without having to double click on each one. You just go to 
options list or control B and you just select and you just delete and that will clear the chart for you so that's all for today's video um, we hope you found it very helpful and um, have a, a good week and good trading